Hi, my name is Joaquin de Posada. I only have a couple of minutes. I have to go into a TV interview. But I just wanted to discuss with you my latest book, Don't Eat the Marshmallow Yet. In Spanish, No te comas el marshmallow todavía. You know, this book has become an international bestseller. It was named the best book of the month by the New York Times. It has been translated into several languages, including Spanish, Portuguese, Russian, Japanese, Chinese, even Korean, to mention a few. It's number one in the bestseller list in Korea right now. It has done it for 16 weeks in a row. And guess who it beat? Harry Potter. So Harry Potter finished number two. Marshmallow finished number one, 2005, in Korea. Let me explain what the book is about, because it's a very serious subject. There was an experiment done in the University of Stanford a few years ago. They took four-year-old kids all by themselves, and they placed each kid in a table with a chair, and they placed one marshmallow in front of the child. At that moment, they told the kid, Johnny, I'm going to leave this one marshmallow in front of you for 15 minutes. I have to go out. When I, go, when I get back, if you have not eaten it, if I see this marshmallow here, I will give you another one. So you'll have two. However, if you eat the marshmallow, you will only get one, the one that you have here. Do whatever you want. Very interesting what happened. Two out of three kids ate the marshmallow. They could not withstand the impulse to eat it. One out of three did not eat the marshmallow. They had the discipline, they had the strength, the will not to eat it. And they had two in 15 minutes. Well, 15 years later, they go back and they follow up on those children. Now they were 19, 20 years old. And what they, what they found is absolutely amazing. It's such an important concept, I needed to write a book about it. Every single child that did not eat the marshmallow was successful. Good grades, they were in school, good relationships. Uh, in fact, they even had an average of 215 points higher than the kids that ate the marshmallow in the entrance exam of the university. They were doing very well. A lot of the kids that ate the marshmallow had dropped out of school. They had difficulties. They were not doing well. They had low paying jobs. They had difficulty thinking skills. They were not in a situation as good as the ones that were able to withstand the impulse to eat the marshmallow. This has given us a very important clue. The ability to delay gratification is the most important factor to achieve success. So I needed to write about it. Now there are other principles that I go into the book. In the book I go into those principles. Successful people are willing to do things that unsuccessful people are not willing to do. That's a very important principle. The 30 second rule, it is not fair, but it's part of human behavior. You have to make a good impression within 30 seconds because people will judge you based on those 30 seconds. Successful people keep their promises. Now more than ever, we need everyone to keep their promises because it's happening more and more that people do not do what they say they will do. Establishing trust and the power of influence, also essential principles in success, will be covered in the book. So, buy this book, clicking on the link, link below. However, you might want to hire me to do a keynote based on the book, which will give you a, a way to transform the way your people think. And I can assure you, it will take them to the ne next level in your organization. So give me a chance, and you'll see that we can accomplish great things if we work together. Thank you so much.